I'm Noah with Limitless Van and we're here on a super hot day at Adventure Van Expo. I want to show you around our demo van for the 2021 season. Come with me, let's check it out. All right, so we'll start off here at the front with our roof rack. This is our design that we manufacture here in-house in North Bonneville, Washington. Those are LP, Baja Design LP6 lights up there. We got 300 watts of solar on the roof and it's fully decked and modular. Along with our roof rack is this side ladder to, and then also our rear tire carrier. So for all-wheel drive models, you get a step that comes through the hub and the wheel. Um, most importantly, of course, a bottle opener on the bottom. That is you know, key feature, of course. Um, and then no drilling is required to get the ladder in or this rear tire carrier. Okay, so continuing on the tour, this is our garage space. Um, so in here we got our 20 gallon fresh water tank that sits over our wheel well. And then just for fun, because we could, we added a sight glass. So not only can you see your water level from up on the red arc system, but you can just look in there, glance to see your water level. Along with outdoor shower, now it's right here. Quick disconnect, plugs in. Your mixer's right there. A lot of our customers are using shower tents right here, so instead of having a shower inside, it's a great solution. We do also do one piece aluminum showers for interiors of vans as well. Moving on, this is all of our battery components, so no storage in here, but in this particular van, there's a single game changer, 270 amp hour lithium battery, a 3000 watt inverter, and then the Red Arc brains, relays, fuses, all of that lives in this cabinet. This van is our demo van, so it's got a little bit of everything, including onboard air. So it's an air compressor running underneath the van, mounted where the rear tire carrier, or the rear tire used to be before we mounted on our rear tire carrier. You got your gauge here. That's great for airing up paddle boards, tires, kayaks, everything. Everything that needs air. <laughs> And then uh, this garage space has a pass-through in the partition. So we're big fans of making a garage space and making a living space. So all your wet gear, if you're out in the snow, skis, all of that, it lives back here. And it's heated separately with our Rixens heater. So you can dry all your gear back here with its own vent and uh, keep it out of your living space. All right, so for the next section, we're gonna jump to the inside of the van. Um, starting with our galley. So we make all of our cabinets in here. We come from a cabinet background, so you notice it might become apparent as we go through here. But we got a flip down workstation with magnetic insert, um, which is perfectly sized for a Snow Peak single burner uh, isobutane stove. So you can cook outside, keep the smells out of your van. We've got power outlet with USBs out here. It won't smash if you accidentally leave it open and close your door. Um, and then moving right along, we've got this is on a lock. This opens up. We've got a uh, extended workstation for your kitchen, or uh, silverware storage underneath here, or cash drawer, which you know sounds cooler. That's cool, right? Isotherm fridge and freezer combo. We can fit a larger system in here if you'd like, but you lose your cutting board. Stepping on up. Um, and then up in the van, we've got, this is a rear seat swivel. So nobody made one that we were aware of. So we made one ourselves at a 316 steel that goes right on top of our seat base that locks into L-Track, fully adjustable. So this rotates when you're driving down the road. So it's safe, your seat belts do their job, but then it rotates out of the way so you can get through your van, have lots of space. And this is where you want to sit. Anyways, you don't want to be sitting out the windshield and this lagoon table swivels around. Everybody can hang out. It's great. We were in here last night as well when we weren't on the roof rack. We got a Rivati sink in here, 20 gallons of fresh water storage, seven gallons of gray storage underneath the sink. This is removable by hand. You can dump it outside if you're using biodegradable soap. Um, overhead cabinets, these all light up inside. We've got our internal cell phone booster right there. That's the transmitter portion of it. This shelf right here close to the bed, this is your wireless charger. So you just throw your phone up there, it's built right into the shelf, charge your phone, 
Um, we're out here at the event all weekend. I naturally forgot my phone charger, so that was great. No cable required. <laughs> Charged it up and I was ready to go. Um, this van has a whole JL audio system, so subs behind the seat and then a thousand watts of six by nines everywhere else. Um, this is the head unit interface for that right in our um, headliner shelf that we make. The Ford one does the job, but it's a little flimsy and it doesn't have a lot of storage space. So we added all of this with our custom metal shop. Up here, we did all the sensible upgrades. So this is a 3.5 liter EcoBoost Ford. Um, and then it has the interior upgrades like the eight inch screen, blind spot monitoring, obstacle avoidance, all the sensible upgrades. Um, got overhead storage, our upright storage here, stainless shelves. Again, making it apparent that we have that full metal shop. We love to do metal fabrication. So, and then on this side of the van, you can see we've got a pull-out toilet. So this pulls out. It's on drawer glides, but it has Teflon sliders on the bottom. So when you get on it, your weight's on the floor and not on the glides. Locks away nicely, not to be seen. And then right here is your pass-through to the garage. This particular van is equipped with a biometric safe. Put my thumb on it, opens right up. A pistol or cash, keys, whatever could go in there, hidden away. Induction cooktop. And this is the whole electrical system interface. We use Red Arc, which is awesome. It's this one screen for everything besides the dimmers and our heater. Everything goes through here. So all your channels for electrical, all your lights, um, along with tank levels like water tank, fresh and gray, right here. It tells you how much solar is coming in, DC to DC charging shore power, all managed by this unit. We love Red Arc, super easy to use. All right, thanks for taking a look around our van. We're here at the Hood River Adventure Van Expo, which is kind of our hometown. We're right across the river to our shop um, and fabrication is. So uh, if you didn't catch this one, come meet us at the next one. We're going to all the other expos. Hope to see you out there.